Let's kick it karaoke for a minute. I used to actually come here every single day and study. Okay, today I want to talk about why I became vegan, starting with college. High school, I was skinny, I, I, I was ripped, I had abs, basically, college. I had to study a lot, had four jobs, no time to work out anymore at all. I became a fat boy, okay? So I know what it is to be fat. The American diet is not exactly uh, healthy. You, got, you have to be very vigilant and watch how much sodium, fat, all that stuff. Anyways, so I got fat. That didn't make me very happy, so I started working out. I started doing push-ups at home mostly because I didn't have time to go to the gym or the money. So I just started doing push-ups. After a year and a half, I lost most of the weight, actually. But the, the thing about it is, it's kind of hard to maintain weight loss sometimes. The weight always goes like this, right? Up and down, up and down. You gotta be careful, because most people gain weight maybe one pound per month, so it's very slow, you don't even notice it. The benefit of becoming vegan that I've noticed so far is I can maintain my weight without trying as hard. Before, I really had to like pay attention, calorie counting, did I work out today, did I work out long enough? So I, I really had to pay attention to that and, and what I ate. Being vegan, I still have to pay attention to what I eat, but I do not have to pay attention to calories. I mean, I can eat 3,000 calories right now and eat another 2,000 for dinner and not exactly worry. I'm not saying I don't gain weight, I'm saying that I can eat more calories than before for some reason, which I feel like it's kind of a benefit. At being vegan, I can maintain my weight. Was it hard to uh, be vegan from the start? Yes. I used to have dreams of beef at night, <laughs> okay? I used to see, like, see meat in the fridge, you know, because people in my house are not vegan. I'm like, uh, our pizza. Vegan for six months, yay! Is, is there a thing, is there an anniversary for that? I mean, is it like a vegan birthday? I, I, I don't know. But this was actually just me trying it, and so far it's, it's, it's all good. I, I'm doing okay. I do miss, can't talk, I do miss fish. I'm not gonna lie to you, at the same time fish does have a lot of mercury and other probably things going on from pollution in the ocean. But I really do miss fish, especially living in Japan and sushi everywhere, that's my only kryptonite, the sushi. I didn't get into veganism to lose weight. That was not the reason. I didn't get into it for the idealism. I just want to be healthier. And I feel like eating beef and pork and all that stuff. You know, when I was eating it, I didn't feel it as healthy as I do not eating it, actually. So, so I would never force anyone to become vegan. Like. I'm not gonna treat it like a religion. It's not a religion, it's a lifestyle and or a diet. You, you can pick to do either or. I do the diet, I'm not concerned with the lifestyle. Like it, go ahead and try it. Uh, make sure you do your research. Meat does provide you with vitamin B12. And you do need this for your neural processing in your brain. And, and if you have a vitamin B12 deficiency long enough, it can cause problems. So you gotta make sure you're taking vitamin shots for B12 or some kind of supplement. I'm not sure if they have the correct kind over the counter, but just jump on YouTube and do the research. It takes 10 minutes. That's about it. Anyways, if you liked the video, uh, please subscribe. If you have any questions, just go ahead and hit me up in the comments. Peace until tomorrow. Good girl, turn me on till the early morn. Let's get it on. Let's get it on till the early morn. It's all good.